10 Most Ancient Dog Breeds on Earth Welcome back to Top 10 Steam. Dogs are companions of humans. They have been from the start of humanity. Today's list is about the top 10 oldest dog breeds on Earth. Number 10. The Sha Pei This is a breed that originated in ancient China. The Sha Pei is a dog breed believed to have originated in 206 BC during the Han Dynasty. Because the clay ornaments and the dog's likeness have been dated to that period, the figurines cannot be mistaken for other dog breeds. The Sha Pei has a distinct appearance with familiar skin folds and wrinkles. However, despite their appearance as lazy lumps of skin, they were notable for their superior foraging and herding abilities. The Sha Pei was thought to have been a loyal companion to farmers in ancient China who kept their land and livestock safe from predators and other dangers. They are, however, ideal friends for single people or families with older children these days. Because of their independence, they prefer not to be bothered the majority of the time. So as a result, these dogs are not very good with children. Number 9. The Chow Chow The Chow Chow, despite its British name, can be traced back to ancient China and Mongolia. Chow Chow meat was once considered a delicacy and the industries once used its thick fluffy fur to make coats. However, their primary function was to guard and protect ancient Chinese temples, which they began doing between 150 and 200 BC. Chow Chows are known as Zongxi Quan in China, which means puffy lion dog. It's known for its blue tongue and lips, which are a one-of-a-kind feature. Chow Chows have a reputation for being aggressive to people because they were bred to guard and protect. They have a short fuse and aren't particularly good with children. Number 8. The Alaskan Malamute The Alaskan Malamute is not only the largest but also the oldest sled dog breed. They were domesticated by the Melamed tribe between two and 3,000 years ago. They are named after the tribe as well. The Malamute tribe bred them to be big and strong. These dogs were primarily used for hunting big game and pulling heavy sleds loaded with gear and meat. They are still doing what they were bred to do because they are so good at it. Traveling, hauling freight, moving large objects, or recreational sledding and mushing are all reasons to use dogs. They still enjoy hunting, but they have shifted their focus to smaller animals such as rabbits, squirrels, and cats. Alaskan Malamutes are also very friendly and enjoy being around people, making them ideal pets for families, even those with young children. Number 7. The Akita Inu The Akita, originally a Japanese hunting dog, is built for running down game, snow, and rugged terrain in Japan's mountains. They were named after the northern Japanese prefecture of Akita. We are confident that it is an Asian dog breed, but the exact age is unknown. Recent archaeological discoveries suggests that between 8000 BC and 200 BC, a dog known as the Matagi Inu, which is thought to be the Akita's ancestor, existed. That's a considerable time frame, and I'm not sure I want to put the Akita any higher on this list. They make excellent guard dogs and frequently assert their dominance over strangers and even other dogs, despite not being bred for it. Here's an interesting fact for you to consider. Helen Keller received two Akitas in 1937, making them the first of the breed to arrive in the United States. They also gave birth to the American Akita, a species that is now recognized as its own. Number 6. The Shiba Inu The Shiba Inu arrived in America only 60 years ago, but it's the oldest breed that, like the Akita Inu, hails from Japan. Although the breed's exact year is unknown, many experts believe they are older than Akita. As a result, it's a little higher on this list. Their adorable appearance has made them quite popular as pets in recent years, but they were most likely bred for hunting like most ancient breeds. They have a lot of energy, like most hunting dogs, but it's not as high as some of their peers. Number 5. The Afghan Hound The Afghan Hound is an ancient sighthound that was first bred thousands of years ago by nomadic peoples in Afghanistan, Pakistan, and northern India. Again, pinpointing the breed's exact origin is difficult, but the history has traced back to at least 8,000 years ago. The Afghan was an expert hunter who had experience killing large and small game, including antelopes and possibly leopards. It was brought to England in the 1800s and was one of the first dogs shown in dog shows by the Kennel Club of the United Kingdom. Beginning in the 1970s, they became popular as pets and show dogs, and it's still easy to see why. Its swirling coat and wavy tail is usually recognized as being amongst the most beautiful amongst dogs. Because its long, silky coat becomes tangled so quickly though, they require daily hair brushing. Number 4. The Pekingese 
These have long been regarded as a secret in China, bred as companion dogs for the ancient Chinese imperial family. Their original lines were shrunk to miniature size by the Buddha, according to an old Chinese legend. Only the imperial family and no one else was allowed to own one. They were unknown to the rest of the world until the British brought them back from China in the 1860s. They are still known for their lion-like qualities of dignity and determination. However, because these canines were once bred as royal, sacred animals, they developed a snobbish attitude. They don't seem to like anyone or anything, including children, strangers, and other pets. They are also obstinate and difficult to train. Pekingese owners will tell you that you don't own a Pekingese, it owns you. Number 3. The Chinese Saluki Experts have determined that the Saluki is among the top three most ancient dog breeds through DNA analysis. Moreover, Salukis are one of 14 breeds that are the most closely related to wolves. There are also records of this breed dating back to 329 BC in Egypt and 685 BC in China. Their distinctive slim profile gives them the appearance of being delicate and fragile, but they are extreme and have seemingly limitless endurance. They were bred for speed, strength, and endurance as sight hounds. Many of these characteristics are still present in modern Salukis, which have been observed chasing squirrels, goats, otters, foxes, raccoons, snakes, and deer. These slender dogs have been known to reach speeds of over 30 miles per hour while chasing. Number 2. The Tibetan Mastiff The Tibetan Mastiff is thought to be the progenitor of all Mastiff breeds, which means that any Mastiff will have Tibetan Mastiff in its pedigree. According to recent research, this breed descended from the grey wolf around 58,000 years ago. They are that old. It is also the only dog breed capable of living at altitudes of 4,000 meters. It's because, like the Tibetans, they have physical adaptations that allow them to do so. Having less hemoglobin in their blood, for example, helps them avoid clots and strokes that can occur when the body produces more red blood cells in an attempt to obtain more oxygen at a higher altitude. This enormous dog came to America from Tibet, where the dog was used to protect sheep from predators such as wolves, leopards, and bears. While its protective nature is often a good thing, the Tibetan Mastiff is not the best choice for a novice dog owner. These 150-pound dogs are strong enough to be a bear deterrent. Now, it's time for the pick of the day. Today's best choice is a breed that has long been thought to be the world's oldest dog. Number 1. The Basenji According to many experts, the Basenji is the world's oldest dog. According to a scientific study that compared the genomic analysis of 161 current dog breeds, this is the case. They are such an ancient breed that they don't even bark, instead emitting a high-pitched howl that sounds like a mix of a laugh and a yodel. In any case, if the Basenji makes a sound, you can be sure it's a Basenji. Their origin started on the African continent, where these dogs were used for hunting and tracking prey. While the Basenji's age is unknown, it is known that they were given to the pharaoh as a gift in ancient Egypt. The portraits of these dogs were also depicted in hieroglyphics in ancient Egypt. Basenjis are curious and energetic animals who require a lot of exercise to stay healthy. But on the other hand, an inactive Basenji can and will be destructive. They are high energy dogs who enjoy climbing and can quickly scale a chain link fence. Have any of these ancient dog breeds ever belonged to you? Let us know what you think in the comment section below. See you next time. Check out this other recent clip from Top 10 Steam and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.